hanging out here this morning and I wanted to share a quick little tip with the uh, voiceover community. The one thing you might be forgetting to include on your website. What is that? Well, of course, you guys are including your demos and your contact information and your social media profiles and there's probably a nice headshot or a logo and a little paragraph that talks about the type of voice you are and the type of work you do. But the one thing you guys might be leaving out is your availability. When are you able to record voiceovers? Now for the full-time voiceover talent that solely makes their income just from recording voiceovers, it's probably not an issue because you're available from nine to five or nine to six. But even for those folks, are you remembering to include your time zone? You know, the folks who are in California operate on a slightly different clock than you guys do on the East Coast or Canada or even Europe. So maybe for your full-time voice talent, you want to make sure to put your time zones that you're available. And for the part-timers or the moonlighters or for the hobbyists, um, if you have a full-time gig doing something else other than voiceover, it would be helpful to let your clients and potential clients know when you're able to record. The last thing I want when I'm vetting a new voice talent is to offer them up an audition or a gig and then I find out, well, I only record voiceovers uh, after hours or I only record voiceovers on Tuesdays and Thursdays because when uh, I need you, I need you now. So uh, take a quick look at your website and it's a simple change. Add uh, your time zone, add the hours that you are available to record voiceovers and I'm sure that'll be a big help uh, to inform your clients and potential clients. Go get it.